Okay, my EcoFlow solar panels have arrived pretty much on time. I'm going to have to open them at the front here because um, they're too heavy together to carry down the back and of course I do everything on my own. Um, I hope I'm not going to be disappointed. My previous panels have all been Viridian. Quite expensive but beautiful. Really, really first class panels. So uh, I'm fearing the worst with these. Um, the microinverter has been good but let's see. Well, what can I say? They are black on black, as promised. The quality looks good. They're certainly heavy. Um, looks like an excellent panel. Let's see how it performs electrically. So these are the EcoFlow panels. I was expecting the worst, but actually they're, they're, they're fine. Uh, quite a good solid panel, in fact heavy to lift up here, it must be 20 odd kilos, um, uh, but I got them up here. But looking at them, they look nicely made and they're good and solid. So let's see how they behave um, when connected up to the, um, to the microinverters. As you can see, the sun is going down, but I did in the last bit of sunlight today power up these panels. Um, I decided they'll pick up the sun in the morning, so I leaned them here temporarily. I brought out the microinverter, which is tucked under here, connected them in. What did it take me? About 20 minutes, and they were generating straight away. Now, I have come across my first problem. I don't think it's a problem with the system. It's a problem with my uh, Wi-Fi extender. I've got a TP-Link Wi-Fi extender, which is meant to be 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz, but for some reason, I don't think it's outputting 2.4 because these only accept 2.4, and um, it, they can't they can't see it. So I've got a problem a problem with my extender, I believe. The one in the garage over there is picking up from the main hub in the living room and it's getting the 2.4 it needs, but it doesn't reach this far. I'll need to do a bit of work with this um, and see if I can get it sorted for tomorrow. So we've got Enphase and we've got EcoFlow and right next to each other and they generated the same amount of power. It's a very good sign, especially the EcoFlow is in a slightly worse position.